Hello everyone, welcome back to another session with me, Pushpa. So today we will be learning what are rational numbers. Okay, so what are rational numbers and how are they denoted? So we will be learning all these today. Okay, so what are rational numbers? How are they represented? So rational numbers are represented with capital Q. Okay, rational numbers are represented with capital Q. Then, so what are rational numbers? In mathematics, rational number is a number such as minus 2 by 6, minus 1 by 3. You can write them as minus 1 by 3, minus 2 by 6 or 1 by 2. That can be expressed as the quotient or fraction P by Q. So what is Q here? You have to first know what is Q. Why do we represent only Q here? Q is nothing but quotient. When you do a division, you get a quotient, right? So that is what this Q represents here. Okay. And that can be expressed as the quotient or a fraction P by Q. So you can directly express the quotient so or you can express it as in the form of P by Q. So what are P and what is P and what is Q? P and Q are two integers and P is any integer but Q cannot be 0. P is the numerator and Q is a non-zero denominator. So if you place 0 in the denominator, it is not valid. You cannot divide any number with 0. Okay, then rational numbers are usually denoted by capital Q. Okay, they are denoted by capital Q. Then it was thus denoted by in 1895. So this capital Q was denoted in 1895 by Giuseppe Piano. Okay, Giuseppe Piano. So from where it he was an Italian mathematician, and what was a quotient in Italian? It is quoziente. Okay, it is quoziente. So for Italian, it is quotient is quoziente. So that's the reason they have put up Q here. So, Q is nothing but quotient. So, you are dividing two numbers and or you are writing two numbers and the fraction is called a rational number where and P and Q can be integers. Okay. So, that's all for today. Thank you for watching. Have a good day. If you like my video, please do like, share and subscribe my channel.